hi my friends how are you um i'm holding here the perfumes that i will be talking about today and i just want to ask how are you doing and how is your perfume day today and which perfume are you wearing so this is the new perfume to me and i was wearing it wearing it today and i was very delighted guys but yesterday i was wearing this perfume and this perfume really deserves uh an, another video this is like <laughs> i need to do like unboxing video but guys i already unboxed it and i wear it um yesterday and it's pretty good is by zara guys this perfume so first of all when i went to the middle eastern perfume shop um so i um i didn't bought anything guys but this one i bought uh some time ago a few weeks ago but uh, i was in middle eastern, middle eastern perfume shop and i wanted to buy this yellow version of this one uh, and i didn't bought it but i still think i'm gonna get it in the future the reason why because i think it's pretty good you know that particular yellow perfume it could be even better than this but what's the experience of wearing this perfume throughout the day guys i enjoyed it um uh, i enjoyed it uh, and i will show you how the bottle looks like um how to say when they say that there is that candy candy type of smell it is candy smell and it is really feminine and it is good you know it's really good to have middle eastern perfumes that would be not heavy and that would be light-hearted and it would be feminine and it would be like sweet and it would be easy to wear and like nobody would be disgusted by by this type of perfume so i think these type of perfumes are very welcomed you know in the middle eastern perfumes uh, those you know those choices there because uh, a lot of other choices that you can see it's really only heavy perfumes and only some could be not heavy so so this perfume uh, I'm kind of getting you know that blocked nose again guys but like but really I really enjoyed it guys it was really in the notes as I read two days ago there was vanilla you know there was some um, is it heliotrope and there was something else but overall guys it smells really like a candy like candy like smooth vanilla and there was musk as well so that musky smooth candy like vanilla that is really <coughs> is really guys is very pleasant to wear and uh, throughout the day like you could feel this type of smell that is very pleasant and feminine you know and i haven't got guys any type of um uh, co uh, compliment yet but it's too early to say but overall i think this one could be some kind of like a uh, little bit like a compliment getter but but um, that type of compliment getter that would be uh on the pleasant side but not nothing too ex nothing too major you know nothing too um, fancy uh, you know this perfume like it's nothing too like really fancy about this perfume but at the same time it's pleasant and it's really pleasant to wear and it's feminine you know i'm repeating myself again and again for so because it's such an easy choice throughout the day you know uh as you're choosing perfume for that reason it's really advantage that this perfume has um of that versus Fertility factor you know that another perfume dirham vardi by ardal safran so that one i used to say that i like that one very much but i think which one i like more guys i think i you know i really like this one more that's what i would like to say i like this one more because it's a little bit more sweet and a little bit maybe more interesting i'm do i i feel always scared of the musk musk musky type of perfume so this perfume has musk but it only has at the base and it mixed with vanilla type of uh, candy smell that that musk actually at the end doesn't disturb the situation at all and another day guys next day i'm gonna do uh, you know video about this eternal devotion after i went to the middle eastern shop uh, you know when i didn't bought anything in middle eastern perfume perfume <laughs> shop that day but but i went to zara perfume shop and i immediately guys i immediately found perfumes uh, that uh, kind of that i would be reaching for more often so light-hearted perfumes you know this type, i'm gonna do video guys about these perfumes but like this type of uh, light-hearted, fresh perfumes, you know, there is some kind of like, I don't know, like um, black currant there. It's written those note, uh, notes, uh, notes uh, eternal devotion, black currant, rose, turkey, and ambroxan. And they released uh, those type of, there are many other bottles like this there, but really worth trying. I smelled also summer tuberose as well in Zara, and it was really good, uh, you know, and uh, it's really nice, guys, to have this type of perfume 
perfume. Another perfume that I was testing out is another 13, you know, this perfume. And um, I need to do a separate video, but guys, this is powerful, guys. Right? Another, another 13. I think I do prefer another 13 more than Santal 33, but Santal 33 is also very interesting. That her herbal quality that Santal has is um, a little bit unusual, you know, and for that reason, uh, I like that one too. But but this one is just like a powerhouse, you know, what that's what I would like to say. You just like, I, I just dab, you know, so little on, you know, on, on ev anywhere, on the pulse points or whatever. And it just, it starts, you know, the smell, it just starts appearing and it lasts very long. It's just so powerful. And this, guys, another 13 is probably, you know, one of my could be one of my favorite you know together with those eccentric molecules you know and stuff like that and it has this type of little bit of eccentric molecules or one type of vibe but it's different and more profound you know it has some other notes that makes this perfume more profound i think this one is definitely a compliment getter guys and uh, really it's a perfume it's when you want to wear something special on a special day you know this perfume it really could draw people you know when you wear this perfume and i really like it <coughs> really really like it need to do another video guys about this perfume i can't even remember if i already sprayed this one or not but let me spray it again it's really guys so nice guys so nice i'm sure i'm gonna get that yellow version uh that mango version as well and it e exists also the white version isn't it which i don't think i had a chance to smell it but these perfumes are affordable and quite nice and you can spray it so many times i'm sure i'm, I'm gonna finish guys this perfume like within um, three years you know i'm gonna finish this perfume from the beginning until the end because uh that's what it means when it's so easy to wear one of the other days guys i'm gonna do the video about another 13 because i have a 15 ml bottle you know i got it and really really worth like you know when you say mm, buy expensive one and you know you will feel quality so it's really when you buy expensive perfume you know as the as such it's really like really really pleasant guys um like really different when you wear affordable version and expensive version you know really different you know one uh, subscriber recommended me you know to do that to buy expensive perfume and it's really worth it you know but at the same time when you look at those affordable perfumes it will it also guys like gives you pl pleasure these perfumes as well you know like when you spray it it's really nice or, or at the same time if you mix little bit of expensive one and affordable version that could be a great combination like really like i feel really pleased guys with these perfumes and with those choices that zara has you know uh, those those expensive perfumes what they have but of course you need to be ready to buy them and what those uh, middle eastern perfumes what they have just uh, i noticed a little bit shortage of refreshing and you know those type of easy going perfumes in middle eastern perfume type of shops that's what i see guys uh, at the moment so that's it i hope you're gonna have a fantastic day what's your perfume guys what's your perfume that you're wearing and um, do you have any type of expensive perfume that you you know that you wear what's your signature scent guys i could say that at the moment my signature scent could be another 13 guys mixed with uh, with other ones uh, i'm mixing it with uh, with zara perfumes with anything because this perfume will be pulsating you know from your skin like throughout the day and it will give you really will give you really nice smell so i'm gonna come back to you next time bye bye guys have a beautiful day bye, -bye.